Hi lovely viewers, it's me again, your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. Uh, we also have uh, Honorable Brian Munduvile MP. Uh, Honorable Munduvile, good morning and welcome to the program. Good morning to you. Um, I'm greatly honored to be uh, featured on your program today. And indeed, uh, it's a good morning to all the listeners. All right, thank you very much. And uh, last but not the least, uh, we have uh, Honorable Stephen uh, Kampiongo. Now, Honorable Munduvile is an uh, MP from Parokoso, if I'm not mistaken. Thank, right. thank you very much. And we also have uh, uh, Honorable Stephen Kampiongo, Honorable Member of Parliament for uh, Shiwangandu and also Chief Whip. Uh, is it a chief whip in the opposition? <laughs> <laughs> Are you the whip of the opposition? Now, Dr. Pondamani. Chikankala chitako wafi atichalo chana chishwanga matila fika mpio ngo waishu ati mwina shwangandu. Wafuma kuhishin sari, kuhito nto kushumaru wangomu wa ichewe luwa ngaru wa kusashila. Ganshi luwa ngaru wa shuulimi. Kwa toja di chine chine, for, you know, you giving us this opportunity to engage the people of Kawe, Central Province, and uh, all the listeners that will have uh, uh, an opportunity to listen to us, it's really uh, great. If we could turn that one, that turn the baby ten months, if you want to turn the ten to go to Shishi, not to go to the moon, if we 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 go to Pantu apupari yo insa utupere yo nshishi wefu tuwala kwa nisha pantu bonsa yifu kwa ina Tuwaishu wanga tuwambo kupongo mkela pantu wafili wale mfu Lelo lesa ala pala tumono futu wala mfu ya kashita mwala tukera yo Alright, thank you very much SG, uh, I suppose you are the delegation leader uh, We're looking at the political and economic situation in the country uh, Where you left and where we are Just give us an outline uh, well, First of all, I think it's important for us to register uh, fact that we are in cover uh, in you know in solidarity of our colleagues who were incarcerated uh, a few weeks or slightly in a, over a month ago uh, in Mansa uh, over a case um, I would say we have commented publicly uh, which we believe uh, ultimate justice will be meted out. Uh, we believe it was uh, orchestrated, schemed uh, for political reasons by the UPND. Uh, there were certain processes we, under, we had undertaken uh, to expose that scheme, including reports that were lodged at the Judicial Conference Authority, and uh, obviously also the evidence that was uh, adduced before court. But as it were, sometimes the wheels of justice are slow, uh, but we're very confident that at the end of the day, the truth will prevail. Pronouncements from UPND were just after 2021 elections. There were specific consequences that were targeted. You know, Misaka Index might pronounce himself that he wanted, for example, Kabushi at all cost. He wanted Kwacha at all cost. He wanted uh, Pambashe and Kaombo at all costs, and uh, you know uh, we have put up a spirited fight to avoid by-elections. But as it were, uh, we are not relenting, but making sure that the right thing is done in the interest of preserving democracy. Um, our lawyers were obviously arguing a, a matter to which. Uh, you know, Honorable Mundu will be able to comment on, and that's a mission uh, for which we can. But we also wanted to take advantage of the time that we're here mm -hmm. to speak to issues that uh, the people of Kawe and Central Province have been calling upon us, that we yearn and desire that we interact with you because of the difficulties that they're going through, uh, difficulties in relation to issues of governance, difficulties in relation to issues of the economy. Um, when it comes to the economy, I think it's now very clear that our friends have lamentably failed. Mm -hmm. 
today the headline in one of the tabloids actually indicate that the Ibinaka in the in all his egoistic attitude, he has now accepted that we are at the verge of an economic shutdown. He is now going around with the begging bowl, though too late, to try and see if we can solve the situation. Um, the signs that the economy is failing are clearly seen in the cost of living. Today, against all the promises that the OPND made and the propaganda they waged in 2021, the cost of millimeter, Wunga number, but then that if we have to do that, one twenty, one fifteen. We have to figure the pari four hundred. No kuya pantash. Hello, nangwa budure in other parts of the country, the commodity is not even available. In some places where the commodity is available, it's poisoned. Avant to bare the wungo wakwata poison irelengo kutira irepera avant to makanza mwanwa kutira wadeta you know import the gemos. What is the importing? I'm at the over the Perambia Mamiras, according to the Vagai of Bunga, Kurifi Varanda Mtsungwat Afro toxins, which are causing, you know, not only the death of dogs and other, you know, livestock, but also the study from UTH at the cancer hospital. It has shown that most of the cancers that are being registered have to do with the digestive system, and it is related to Afro toxins. So these are matters which, uh, as PF, we are concerned about and want to change the government. We can but the UPND is more complex. So there are many things that we can talk about, but as it were, let my colleagues also be able All to... All right, thank you very much. Um, Honorable Mondevile, um, yeah, you've been uh, given that task. Uh, firstly, I would uh, want to understand, uh, I want to watch some Kumana, and then you can comment on what has happened in court. Why are you here? Uh, obviously, the conditions in prison uh, uh, are not the same as one who's got um, his freedoms, uh, living with his family, and uh, in his conditions as it were. Uh, so, as regards uh, the matter that we came for today, uh, our lawyers had made an, an app a bail application uh -huh. uh, for those of our colleagues who are incarcerated who were actually convicted. Uh, as you know, Kuli Mbalishibidi. Uh -huh. The others who were uh, convicted and not sentenced. Uh, the, the others who were convicted and sentenced, uh, we applied for bail. Uh, because of the nature of the application, it was actually a chamber application where our lawyers were given an opportunity to argue their case uh, before the judge. And uh, the judge will make a ruling on the 20th of this month, sometime next week, on the bail application. Uh, there was also uh, Another application that was before the judge, uh, you know that uh, uh, some of our colleagues were convicted but not sentenced. Uh, the sentencing will come later before uh, the High Court judge. Now, uh, within the law, uh, provisions are such that uh, uh, before a judge, uh, uh, you know, sentences, he must be convinced that the conviction was proper. So there's been an application uh, to. Uh, the effect that uh, the judge should review the conviction before sentencing. So that particular application, the ruling will come out um, in October. That's right. In between now and that time, they will remain incarcerated? They yes, they remain, they, they remain in custody. Yes, they All remain right. in custody in the meantime. Okay. Uh, Honorable Kampiongo, you were Minister of uh, Home Affairs, and uh, we have seen these um, one to arrest. Uh, we've seen these arrests. We saw the arrests in the PF also. Uh, you were Minister of Home Affairs. Maybe you can give us a comparative analysis of the rule of law. Well, um, interestingly, I, I think maybe just to add a little bit on what uh, my colleague was saying about our brothers and colleagues who we came to um, offer solidarity uh, is that Honorable Chilangwa's ruling will be on the 20th, I think, if I'm not mistaken, September like he has rightly explained, because he was sentenced, uh, but he, the, 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 there is an appeal that has been launched uh, in, his, 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 in this matter. Um, you asked me to do a compare and contrast. I think he, it, it, it's just fair to say that instead of comparing, because 
com comparing and contrasting, you should be talking about numbers, our people. We have the same human resource uh, in the law enforcement agencies. And we're talking about the Zanga police and, uh, uh, of course, the other agencies. But those that are responsible for enforcing um, law and order, mainly it's the Zanga police service. And so we more or less like have the same human resource. So it's like how we manage the same human resource. Uh, just as they would say, bad carpenter who always bring his tools. And so when you are utilizing the available tools properly, uh, according to the law, I think it shouldn't be, 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 it shouldn't be a problem. Yes, uh, police have got a mandate to perform beyond a political cycle. Okay? The, 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 the way they, they are supposed to be is like, Polit uh, political parties would, 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 would come in a democratic uh, state uh, and go. But that human resource you built in the police service must outlive these political cycles. That's a desirable thing to do. Uh, but unfortunately, we have seen it differently where um, some, some, some senior officers who have served the, 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 the service have, have been plugged out of the service in an unceremonious uh, way. You don't build a nation like that. Because then you'll be saying every regime that comes, they would have to plug out those that they perceive to have been uh, unprofessional or politically inclined uh, with the, 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 ruling, the particular ruling party at a given time. So that shouldn't be the desire. So my plea, instead of making a compare and contrast, is to just appeal to the police service to continue discharging their duties within the confines of the law. And when you hear that, only those that are not doing the correct thing should be worried. Because even then, we have institutions that should offer, should, uh, uh, you know, uh, offer oversight on the performance of the, 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 the police service. So, all these institutions, it's like they've gone to sleep. There's a police complaints authority where people who feel aggrieved by the, the way they have been handled by the police should run to. But are they functional? The answer is no. You know, you have got the, 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 the Police Service Commission, then that also deals with the, 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 the other matters related to staff welfare. Are they functional? The answer is no. So for me, it, it, it's just to appeal. And it's just unfortunate. I keep saying this and I'll keep repeating that... Uh, while you are supposed to grow the capacity of the institution like Zamba Police with the well-educated officers, you know, uh, who, uh, who are right to take any position in terms of command structure, you can go and wake up someone who retired 10 years or 20, 15 years ago from the service to come back and provide the service because you we don't know this person could have been a cadre. All that time they've been in retirement, they could have been a cadre. And someone remembers that, oh, you remember that policeman, who, that senior man who used to offer us advice and what not, you can bring to, 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 to be police command. That's where we are distorting it. We broadened the command of the Uzanda police so that we can have competent men and women to, to, to commandeer the police service professionally. And the people should rise. Yama, it's a fish of a popular wino. Kumusunga wino, well dressed and at least progress in terms of ranking. And mm -hmm. that ranking should not be looking at the face at all. No. The progression of police officers must be anchored on their profession, uh, capacity, how they've done their in-service uh, you know, training programs, and they are assessed from sergeant to become an inspector, what have you done? Are you able to commandeer your fellow officers to undertake the duties as required? So you find that you get a, 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 a person who is not competent to discharge functions and expect those that are competent under that person to obey that particular person. So that's why we are basing it. So those broadened structure we, we left. You know, we only used to have uh, you know one commission of police uh, uh, probably two of them. Now we said all the divisions should be manned by these senior officers who are able to make decisions within those divisions. Now it's not working because if a division cannot make a decision within the division and they have to refer 
to, to, to headquarters, even with that changed structure, then it becomes a problem. So for me, basically, instead of comparing and contrasting, is to appeal to these men and women in uniform to understand what it means when you are in that uniform. You are a Zambian, you are a human being, and you should make sure that yours is not to align yourself to a political party in government. Yours is to outlive the political cycle of those that uh, form government. So for me, that's why we have a problem. And if they stop getting instructions that you cannot manage and you cannot prove in court, it's better. Because if, I, if me as a politician, I give you, and I used to say this when I was home affairs, that I, the role of a home affairs minister is not to micromanage the Zambia police. Because if you give instructions which are unlawful and someone follows that, the, end, the police is not ending in, the, in themselves. That's why they are courts of laws. Mm -hmm. So if you find that most of the cases that are going to the court are laughable and our officers cannot even defend them, you can even see that this one is, 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 is a bogus case. This one case is borders on someone who could have been instructed, but then they can't go and stand and defend mm -hmm. that before the competent court of law. So that's why the challenge is. All right. Dear listeners, this is a sponsored program. At a later time, we'll be able to open uh, the phone lines, 077-000967. But just for now, let's listen to this uh, bite. You know, sometimes Zambians can make you feel like you have been running the country for 10 years, when it's only two years, six months. <laughs> because they lampoon you with all the problems, even those that you inherited. But then we said, we It is important that as a country, we do things deliberately, not by chance. So I want to say what you're witnessing today. Honorable Nakachinda, there is a claim that, uh, you know, uh, Zambians are blaming uh, the current regime and the problems have created a long time. You left the economy in tatters, uh, prices of commodities and a lot of other things. So the blame is on you, the PF. You must left the economy in tatters. All right. Uh, one of the reasons why uh, we came, we actually we could have actually been all of us, the four of us, including the four minutes of our minds, would have been you know, discussing and debating together, was also to showcase to the Zambian people and the people of Kawe and the central province that we are ready to govern anytime. You press one button after voting us into government, we are ready to run because the human resource in patriotic front is second to none. Uh, that question you've asked, allow me to call upon uh, you know, Honorable Mundu with him to just comment. Then I'll come back because I think uh, in terms of the rule of law, uh, having uh, beaten the record of HH, he has been harassing everybody that he's been you know, arrested 15 times. At least uh, that was for the entire political career uh, up to the time he was voted into as president, 15 times. But he's been in office for less than three years. I've already reached uh, o'clock 20 times based on just political commentary to provide checks and balances. And they obtained the police as their spokes, you know, their PR department, but using arrests as a way of responding to, you know, our challenging this government. Honorable Mundo, they come on. Thank you. Thank you, uh, SG. Uh, <clears throat> yes, I think they, there's been claims uh, by the UPND that we messed up the economy. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, it, it, it's a runaway statement that we hear every day. And secondly, there's been a claim, there was a claim by the UPND that they wanted to double the economy. So our uh, position, uh, as SG has rightly pointed out, uh, would like to uh, just point out a few things uh, under the PF that showed that um, uh, what we did was not to mess up the economy, but uh, grow the economy. And contrast it with the statements made by the UPN that um, has been saying they wanted to double this economy. Now, countrymen and women, the economy is not doubled or grown through speeches. 
You don't double the economy or grow the economy through speeches and rhetoric. It's through uh, practical measures. Let's go back to our time. What did we do uh, to grow the economy? Uh, some of the measures, uh, we, we ran a pro-poor government, but we went to understand what it took to grow the economy and interrogated the reasons why the economy had not grown for a very long time. All we heard about was potential. There's potential in mining. There's potential in tourism. Mm -hmm. There's potential in agriculture. And for a very long time, everybody just talked about potential. So what President Sata and President Lungu did, they took practical measures to ensure that the country realized that potential. Number one, to be able to grow the economy, you have to build infrastructure so that the areas where you have this potential, say in tourism, we went countrywide, ensured that there was what you called backbone infrastructure in various parts of the country. You had communication towers in areas that we never thought of. These are areas where you found waterfalls and other tourism assets. We began to do runways and airdromes. We did road infrastructure. We did uh, uh, energy infrastructure. The idea of uh, 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 creating this backbone infrastructure was that Mpulungu Harbor became an economy. Uh, Kalungwishi, uh, Lumangwe Falls, and all these other areas and the farming blocks. Uh, if you look at the mining sector, you will agree with me that um, the PF government took practical steps to ensure that the country could uh, maximize a benefit from our mines. These are the mines, as Honorable Musuko would confirm, that built this economy soon after independence. And when they went into private mm -hmm. hands, what we had were businessmen who came to maximize profits, evaded taxes, and ensure that they paid the list, and in most cases went out with it. What did we do? We repossessed those mines so that uh, uh, the Zambian government could run those mines, or better still find investors that could um, uh, you know, operate. So to answer the question, when they say, when the UPND is saying, we messed up the economy. The Zambians should ask, how did we mess up the economy? When we improved communication infrastructure, we improved the energy sector from 1,600 megawatts at independence. For 50 years, we're running on 1,600 megawatts. The 10 years that we're in government, we improved it by an extra 2,000 megawatts to go to 3,536. We, we introduced in excess of 2,000 communication towers countrywide. We did 8,000 kilometers of road. So who has grown the economy? Who messed up the economy? Mm -hmm. The three years in government of the UPND, there is no single project that they can boast of that adds to the GDP of this country. All that we have are projects under CDF. We are now seeing ministers commissioning septic tanks and soccer weights, mm -hmm. a confirmation that there's been no infrastructure development under the UPND. Yeah, so uh, to summarize, uh, the, 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 the PF government went out to expand the economy, but they started with the basics. The basics was to ensure that when an investor comes and he wants to invest in Kawambwa, he should be able to find communication, he must, should find power lines, and he should find a road. Then he can put his money in Kawambwa and start growing tea. Before that, uh, there was just land and uh, the potential you know, for, for growing tea. So the PF attended to the fundamentals of growing an economy. The UPND has not done anything whatsoever apart from making pronouncements and speeches that they will double this economy. I just want to say that. Right, we have a question. We have a question. We have a question. We have a question. Bara lenga vena zambe kushita iginovu fuwa wa UPND. And therefore, to achilefe konseptetu kubomba uh, without countering the propaganda. Kwa nga fila fina chava, ulogu fina vumanekila uh, babu ya ilukutila, hawa nesto wakate program, wakate program na angula agenda ya kuleta uyandaji. Kuno kukabwe, hawa minister, wa former minister wa home affairs, wali ishi wakutila, Economy ya kukukabwe outside ama mainzi ya lawa chile provadaizu na kuisala was also supported na the correctional facility. 
mkwadi pa mwanishi ta mweme mdi wale fukutora headquarter kuisa kurusaka but wali mwono kutila most of the economic activities that involve the corruption service if it land up prison we are supporting the business community mwono mkabu wali sayi uwesha that you know headquarter of corruption service kuna kuhu kukabu pa UPND maisa because of selfish interest because our nesu baba UPND wa business men men Ngani wala haka indechi ni mababa ma businesses from the birth of a human being to the death of a human being. Everything in between is involved in that. Ngatu wanda kuma supply ya ma busy ya waka penda ngatu wa fakisha tuka sangu kutila na kwa tamo umunwe na ngula hamdi chikondo. That is how in Rusaka rooting money. He was playing reverse psychology. He was actually the one wanting to move all economic activities into Rusaka. Ngamu wamona mi bombele ya Zambere Ruiz. Na bepaya. And if the corruption facility is more, has been removed to Osaka, Zambia Railway is the bomb we know. I mean, I mean, I can't wait. You see, if you So we can look at many other aspects, even when it comes to infrastructure. The film I just now, we're going to build. At least if we have a PF to ascend, and under the corruption of facilities, Zambia Railway is. I want to back on Central Province. They depend many on the agriculture. What happened? from the security reserve to guarantee that for the next two, three years, in case there is any disruption in terms of weather, we are still able to survive. They forced, Mr. Kandetia forced one of the MPs here in Central Province who are minister, MP Oksam. We are diligent businessmen. We asked the fiance to ask the court to be a court of fear. That's why the court of Unga was a poison. We are not going to be a court of fear. As patriotic front. So in Zambia, I'm a problem Pitamo. They are self-inflicted. Yaku Panga by UPND because of reckless decisions which they have made. Honorable Campion. Maybe before Honorable Campion comes in, you couldn't reopen Mugosh textiles. The UPND have said they are reopening Mugosh textiles. We saw some some containers bringing equipment. So maybe you can comment on that. To Adibeva Venazam, but Mule Lolekesha San. Gavaka in the Valenland. Vaka in the Gavapi showed him Pagano three times, and she a repegano woof. So he am Mugus textile, Gamamone for Valenland, the Ponavaka in the Valenland. Woof work work. Because Abanes they thrive in propaganda. They got into government through propaganda. They are hoping that they will continue to govern through propaganda. They were saying that there are going to be a certain number of containers in terms of. Uh, equipment and so on to capacitate that uh, facility for this. 800 and the 8 have so far read, mm -hmm. uh, the others are doing it. Yes, so out of 400, and we know that the target is basically to revamp one you know, you know, uh, department of that facility. Basically, having tellers, Kula Tungali, you know, some uh, uniform for nurses and so on and so forth. But the fabric will not be generated from there. Because even the negotiations about that reopening that facility are still under, they haven't even concluded. It's like the way they did with KCM Kuchingola. But President Byron, that I have not so far carry KCM. Can she watch it? But the time I didn't know the money, what they told me, who can ambassador of Kuchingola. By the time they are coming to now make a conclusion, they had contradicted themselves many times. The president ran that out at Vepera Vandetta because Ali Filiwe, uh, those who are saying we are giving Vandetta, woof, wake up, wake Next thing, you no, know, we have found another investor and so on. Next thing, Tuasa Sangat, Vepera Vandetta, Mwenyo Valekan. So even the story about um, Murungushi Textiles, if we to refer to Mwenyo Kutila, the only thing is a matter of time because who will figure to a pupareno, but after <laughs> some time, you will be caught in the same web. If you refer to Vepera Kutila, we will vote in it. One just went in ten hours. By fourteen hours, Dora had to say, "Yala boera." Umutengo wa 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 mafuta. But we were saying that our 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 PF police seventeen quarter, our police have about three quarter. So in England, I think that we have three quarter. We have to between twelve and fourteen quarter. How how much is fuel today? Over thirty quarter. So if you continue to believe in Mr. Kanye, it will never rise. You will be banking on you know false hopes. And in the process, it, it limits your innovation to survive. Let's just accept we are in trouble. 
we have to use personal initiative at family level and otherwise to survive. Lelo, kuno, kuni in other parts of Kawe, amala iti ya ilepa nine, ya mwene lelo waka chelo. Nga lelo tu watrafu makurusa kafo ya wambi, nga mwapisho wa msukwa. The whole town was dark. For the first time in the history of this country, the entire Lusaka was in darkness. Because a power in there, nga yaka chelo, kubwela is after midnight, when people are sleeping. Those who are surviving on, you know, welding, you know, barber shops and so on. But about my welding, over the time we got a car order, we got a pansy and two amanite is hanging for zero one. For the two hours that they have power, they will be welding at night. No, about my barber shop, we should do a send them to show that we show them to know amanite is a person to to be able to shift to a lamb of shoes. It can't happen. That is what is going on. On a bagabi. Na tete tete tete. Kakiri pukara mwachiri shayama, tega mwafe yo. Pantu chua mise po, eh, ifi mwa kwa tano mbe fitu wa shitu wa sunga. Efe na lala ndale lo. Mukesa njibu kisha na kudia mshiku. No yu mwaka, no mwaka uka pita po. Muku wa suka ponti na jiku, mkana fina akaru mbe fitu wa ndati. Ukula ndacha alianguka, ukujoba cha alishupa. Nga wamono munove, alevi kajobu. Iwe wewele kutina vika na ten times. Na vya vile tumona kati ya mpira le tea tea Wewele nga wanji ingisha mwana la ingisho tukato ten Nila waku ingisha mwaku ingisho tukato limbi ten one goals Yama wakateka wale ilisha nyo kutila chemo nga watu wateke miaka ten Fila yo Ave ni wali popele fila yo Bali u fix it Kansho fwa wale sa mkuta fix it finish Ni pali ishi mwakuta mwuni uwa afya wale mwana mwubu teko nila tuwale teka ifu Efe wale la ilaba ntukuta ina nga nafika Ama laiti ya kawa mwe Ama laiti mutengo waka wawa watalala tuka wesho Mutengo waka wawa wakali kwa tama laiti na muma kombo ni na mumishu Eri ya shiwa yisina na Vashima famu mwa wafuro mfundo six Yifo tuka la mpela ten Five five Simo sike ufama Pakuti la mkali 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 ni mefi ya kuri efingi Eri ya shiwa yisina na jo No mbale longa baisa tuwawebo kishakoni yisitu wakase ngoma mafi Tefo chukiro kwa na munga ndama fundi tulo epembe lulu waka laisa Pali chisano mai Ukutia wake se kumiyako Fia vini baishi ya tulayo kutila Avu ended road shading Under two years Nomba fwe wa jopere milimo ya pushama na iti Futu wa shibe uchalo muru wuto Awa ntuwe wa alambo kuperuru ya nomba Compare and contrast ya wachikumi yako pa kwamba Pantu Inchi to ifu iloku la ila indila Inanga wa isa njitua tuwa kampiongo Fishi mwa bomba po munu mkawe Na isa kwa na chumutu wandeno na ishiri waka poko la vale Kala mutu mayanda Jotu wa kwa chinga na voma muanda wa Dimbina ilo napa kuingilata wishibe Nisha ishiri mkola ndala ndichila ndela ndewa kateka wala ndirefo kuchia waka Mwane mikari ya waka pokola yala vashani Tuwa isa tuta ama ya nda Nga mwafu mamunu mkabwe wa 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 yama Mule mwana maya ndala yereka na waka pokola Na wawa pongo shina wata ndala Kumuna fika pokolo kwa ishiri na umma uniformu na yama uniformu Tuwa ishiri tuwa ishiri ya ayasu maweno weno Tawe ishi mwene kwa sambile Pa tutuotu maa ndawa yereka lama unga kule Nga ile loka mtu wandina uru wala mmala Pa kutia hunyanya ngareo kufuma munga ndoyo uposo msoro Nisi ya, wapi ya mweka wene So tuwa isa leta kwa mchinshi Nelo mwene 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 Nisi na uishwa ti Imo mwene 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 Prisons Toilet prisons zakane Nomba mwene correction service Yali ni paradigm shift Of changing the whole institution And offender management Mwene 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 Tuwa yambo kusunga shayana wafundwa Pakutila chichinje kumu nifilachale wakane Nga wako vika mchifungo kukusunga fe Nga bulidore sa mungu fumata pali necha chinja Nga wakwa chesho kwa lafumu Fini situwa chitile Atila nda kwa mkala mbo SG yukutila Eti kwa tazi ya correction service Vai shi yifunya kuno vai tuwala kwe kulo saka Tuwebe doke nga chinji cha shupa Na imwewe nena kimusu mbuleko Fila wale tiba gadi jele Na uniform waisa mwana uniform mwari pitaka suwe mikuteni Tuwa isa chinde tuwa wakuli la kwa maanda na umuona maanda ya wakula kufungo kule wa yama Ifi fungo for the first time in the history of this country kusu wakwe chifungo ya chipia Ni mubu teko wesu Mkumu mbeshi ni kuisa Ni mu central province Mwana mfava wa yama Tatuwa pere ili ya pukalonga mili ni ili mga ila kubunga mule ili ya Tuwa nangula Mule mfu Mwana kwa pukunga tuwa chiri ya wa fungwa Fila kale wale batu kwa wakule tefia kule wambi wale ita supply fila wale timpepo Lero ifi ya kuleta filisango wa mprison Tuwa mika meeting plant pale Lero ile ya fwa kwa na wantu kutashani Ukuya mkutanta maka chero chero Wunga ule mwoneka kwa chero ule ichi pako 
é? e farming program ama farm ya ba collection service mbona mwe nafe kuisa mbokunga wa ya ba 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 neosot kwa di bebala twa di bale trena wa machine twa ise mbona mkawe na ba kateka ba Edgar Lungu ukuisa leta fi machine fi abulimi na ba moto kabo ba shale kwa ta babantu twa bale tele kuta mure bomba kwero kwino ngawo ba fi babuteko ama ya ndare moneka wa punda mali Nero ale fumo mushikale na uniform le ronga mona abari bari ba guard jele ba correction service officer bare monika nga bantu Nero ba fa yoku ngise cha nchito abantu bala butukira kono mba nichipite Ero no mbo muntu waisa abwera webere yo tufunye dikotazi tutwale kulusaka after twakula mayanda twakula na fiance ama famu te puno moyeka mukabwe nga waya kuna nsanga fam block kwa we famu ili kalamba na me sheko ya baya kutyo muntu mwa kudonzo mwa kulima irrigation Ia kwa tinga ba tiba mbio kumbwa ya collection service central province ino kutiba kutiba hadi shabu ino kwenye fia kodi ukuisha mfatio ba collection service na wale wachezwe farmu kuliwa zamu beef ni mukabwa na na so nde nde farmu mone ukubomba imiri moja moneka nero nde isamu na mukito muka nde ndo mfanye chuo mbana inenga nde nda na isamu na fiti fia shala pantu wali shapo maski dimax apale pita kabomba maski dimax yalanda Te mana ndaka nwa isa yo, shani, iyo walela ndeyo, infanti ndeyo wakuna wa PS haba wakaremba wa mkala mba wa uteko muno. Wa PS teka nyeni. Stop being a politician. Yes, you were appointed from outside the civil service. Ideally, permanent secretary, jobs, district commissioner, you could get someone who has been in the public service to understand the systems and the functionality of government systems. Bali mula itaen for fine, the easiest thing you do is adapt, learn, Mwasambili labu wangu wangu. Ya nama politics mwere ya anga la mwa ya mkukwela pali mwungoshi textiles. Ya nino kumwere la nomba nine. Ifo ta tuwa tumpile. Ukujisha fila chali. Tuwa lishiwe nchito ya lingino kuchitika hii karamba. Na wa correction service hava ndela ndamu. Wanti tuwa lefu hava sende moru wali. Paku te wambu kuli makoto ni wino wino. Dila mwere isu la chila chambu kula chila vale 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 tungila puefintu. Ni koto ni supply. Ili garantiti. Not for a child, you can't make a child outgrow. So, each child is supposed to be stuck. You can't make a child sustainable. You can't make a child sustainable. Each child is going to be like, you can't make a child sustainable. 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 Mbwa ya chinsho mchila ya chinsho mchila ya naka. Ya isa mwana yewe doyo wana lewe pati. Hei ya kwambila pono kukupepeka. So, epoto nana ndaba ya machaputila. Ifo tu ashile uvulimi bule bomba. Icha lefu wa kakuhulu ndapo. Uvulimi. Tu ashana amatawa. Muma stores room. Muma le mwone filu. Amatawa tu ashile. Tu ale umana filu yonzi naba nesu mparlament. Tu wewele. Ifo fwa ba ishi uvulimi uvu. Mwishiti shefe fwa kudia mwasanga. Mwi. Muma tala. Muma shed. Yo, mwale mwale mtolo wale toloka. We shall never ever. Tulefo kupanga ama dollars. Vaponye nsala. Maponye nsala. So wakateka nga wale lando kutila. Yo, ifo tule lande, chila nde lande. Yo, tule kwa nga pafila yo. Wala ile. Mwatitelisha ni pagulimi. Tukala furisha bantu yu ifu ndo ten ten. Mwaisa ishishe nyanje. No mba mwala lisha bantu nyanje isha wala. Ni muno na bantu omu chile mwale kane ifiwa yama. Tatu shule na na tumla wa sisi tuendu tunofu tulivomba. Ifa tu ashiria malai more than three three thousand megawatts. Elo chai shule shupa ni atua hisa pole chipo 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 we. Paka tu pale twenty seventeen twenty sixteen. Chati chuo pe kwa mbele yao declare the food disaster tu mbele yao hema teka ni ni tu under fin things under control. Na tu shule shupa ni atua kwete. Tatu shule declare disaster national disaster. I tu limo nomba ni mu disaster. We are a country ni disaster now. Just on food, we are uh, in food insecure and the disaster has declared. Vale for Colombia and Dalama Kuba Colombaco. Future Landa, Nibuabo Ayama. To any quarter supplementary budget or to a later proof. In Dalama Shai Slim Colomba Pacova disaster, the Sheriff can only five billion. Well, no, but we support him Kurizesco. He in a Turanda Marite. To a Sheriff 300 megawatts. Kundola Kali Kali Dola in a Jarif 100 megawatts. Tuwa isa ikafuwe goji, dawa isi wale ikunta pafifu baida, basanga naipu, wabu mwenda mwadi mwa, atio tuwa isula maraiti. 
Tuwewele teka nyeni. Bola panishi. Aboba ambo kushisha malaiti kufia rofimbi. Shisha niya malaiti. Bari ilangi lawe ni waka, waka teke lo bali kuchaina. Bebele tuwafikile mkamu for tizon. Tuwaisa mwana kwa tinimuwa. Mbwa na lale. Mwribu. Panti mwenda mwani mwate tuwishi. Kuwa lawa ipusha kuwa shi. Gari mati. Ushi wali minesha niya. Bambo kushisha malaiti. Fia fine chali kumatava. Mwebe kala chalo ndefa mwishi. Fia fine chali kushisha kwa matava kwa buloku misaka mana. Nomba wala mile tila matava ya kucha ya mudu wali kata. Elo ula nda utuwa kwa tamuno. Tule chitanga wa mfwe nsala nomba wala utuko wali. Epo tifikile. Pani tuimwe na hile wa ponda madili mbikutu wako kuchipata wako wa chile wa jili ya frutoksi. Nomba nga wafuma mma kururu. Wali obu wali paku chuke shiba chwa kwa tawa frutoksi ni mumu ili. Miaka milele kuisa kunguka fwe mtu waya. Vashika. Tinali nao. So, efo tila ndacha kutila. Tetipale ilisha nya wakateka. Wakonka nene fila yo. Echo wale nda bayu ufix it. Ineno mbana isa. Ngana afika fya mafuta ya mungu isha nya wa PF wale wapo fili kwacha. Ifo ya kala wapali ten kwacha. Inden. Iyo ya tushirile wa, wa unipi wakaunda na wa yeme mdiba isha. Awa ale sungulu wa mafuta. Tazama pai pila ino mtu wale senda mafuta ya kuleta pa inden. Tua sungulu la. Mwala afuma wa dizeo. Mwafuma wa petro. Mwafuma wa jetefio ya mafuta ya ndeke. Mwafuma HFO. Ya mafuta ya kuya mwiliwa mine. Na mafuta ya kuna mwuri ka, ka ndola energy. Mwaisa isala. Mwebele ifu tuwa kula shitafia mafuta ya nguru wakale. No mba ila pai pila ini ya lele ta crude oil, umu mwale nguru wa mafuta na maproducts ya lefika na nguru. Ten. Mwala pisha mufi diesel. Nde i diesel ile ndano musebo, fia la indila nisha nipa kutu mutengo ube umu ine, uwa chipa. Elo, finish products of chava wa yama. Fia fi ina ichinja munu cha nga bali pembe la bali kutu ya yu wa ila wa ya rabi wa la ndo mutengo wa mafuta pa mpela ya mwishi. Bala wa kwecha mafuta kali kuhiki hata. Bala pembe la tumfo mutengo wa? Wanyo wanyo. Tefi wakashi tuwa yumu eshu uleisa. So wali na stoku hile pa chuwe mkusha nyo stoku. Nishi na hichinja na hichita fractuate. Kanshi ekonomi na ipena. No waku hikata ni mbita paka wenga ya kuwenga ya pula pa hile ndela. So ufo tulela ndaya machaku chafe. Baka teka wafile wa isa la doktor. Mwe chalo nje lele niko. Fila fiyo nsina lela ya fimo fimo. Na hichisupa. Ifo tuwa kwa nishisha ni kusunge chalo. Covid. Eno yo. Ya tebe lele so ndeli onse. Wao di onse. Ewa lehi mini na pachuru bebele. Imu ewa PF tamu kwe temano isa lehi ni chalo. Ifa tuwa isa tontonganyo kutanga tuwa isa lehi chalo. Na tukwa tawa busu. Na tukwa tawa shima business men. Walawa kuta munu mungafu wakuma kururu. Aisa ishisha fio tuntu. Adi ya mungu shuku mungu. No mbanga mwatile chalo tu isa lehi. Mwala ipa ya mantu ne nsala. Ama shikuwe tepa kumoku woko. Efi la tautile na tumwa lupo tuwa laende la. Na mala iti taashi mine. Ne miko tita tuwa isele. No mbelo takuli na COVID. Tulifee chalo no mo. Ama laiti chalo chawa mufifi. Tatu hivyo na pamula basa ni mbikuti hivyo le tulela ndama laiti haya. No mba tuletila. Devo is a liar. Devo is a liar. Lelo tufilo kumono kutila baka teka. Bombe ni milimo. Nga mwa bomba buino efila yo. Tamufi ya nukula ilisha nukutila he. Na mwumba three years. No mba chepo kwa tini ten years. Awe. Nge fifi niti natanta kula ina. Takwa nukutila yo home affairs. Yo baka teka. Mushinka tila isha ni. Waka hama shirikana tawako chama ya nda. Tawako chama uniform. Kui pompa. Let's, let's listen to another clip uh, supplied uh, courtesy of uh, the PF uh, media team. It is Gentlemen, mana wangalia kuhunga, tuma na msuma, and uh, you made them many meal, uh, expensive. Your reaction? <laughs> eh, wow. Well, I think he chose to feel pa palwala. Uwofi wawaka inde, uli palwala. Um, ukufilo kwenaka inde na firon offrance. 
I just want to assure the people of Kawe and the people of Central Province and generally the people of Zambia that we will deploy every divine wisdom and every human resource within the party to resolve the issues that are in you know, internal challenges we have as patriotic front. Because that's a part of choice. Beyond that, the Zambian people have echoed in many ways that I would want you know, President Edgar Chagwarungo to come back into government. But the further presented to us that if there is a way you can work with others, would love that there is an opposition front. Hence, when President Lung came back into active politics, he pronounced that can we work together with others. The first step out of that call was the establishment you know, of UCA by those political parties that responded immediately. But there's been a narrative being suggested that uh, in forging these relationships should be some of the people are basing it on the basis or possibility of uh, President Lungu being blocked from a place of optimism. And therefore, uh, they are counting on that. We want to make it very clear to the people of Zambia that uh, the issue of the eligibility of President Edgar Chagalomu was settled in 2021. Even if, for, for example, uh, President uh, Edgar Chakalungu, by a misfortune, Akainde does something crooked. As Secretary General of Patriotic Front, I want to affirm, we deployed President Lungu into UCA, just like we are open to deploy him to other platforms and political formations. But the responsibility and allegiance of President Lungu and all of us is to PF. If President Lungu, the one who have deployed, mm -hmm. is disfranchised in any way, PF still reserves the right to deploy another person mm -hmm. from ourselves to go and engage where President Lungu ends. So those who want to relate with us from an optimistic point of view, that is not the way we're going to operate. PF is an independent political party. It has its own internal processes, and we anchor what we do from a place of the collective. We have, you know, members of parliament. We have mayors, council chairpersons, councillors. We have the structures of the party across the country. And that is the engine the Zambian people are depending on for them to be able to dislodge this oppressive government. I thought I could just put it out there to assure all Zambians in Central Province that we are not uh, playing a game of taka taka. We know what we are doing. We have a clear agenda on behalf of the Zambian people. President Lung was called upon to be able to marshal support so that we don't allow any spoiler among those in opposition because the Zambians are desperate to dislodge these our friends who are in government. So when we reach out to others, we want to be sincere and honest, but also put our cards on the table. So all right, uh, you can uh, come in on a moment over there, then we just open the phone line so that we can interact with uh, your audience. I'm quite on the money. Each of them watch Tiba, each of them watch Nina, each of them watch Ika. 
chimemba chitila kabili uh, ichi kwanka pachimwena ku mampalanya e abantu wapundo kuti umwana wangala kuvunga te mwana musima iyo president aka inde chilema ala ya abantu ukuti ine ine shughuli mimuneno ngana isa po imi pelele ya mfundo umutengo wa mfundo ukali ngo kutuole kunyipantanshi umutengo wa mfundo ukali sashani tuka pona elofi ishita wa ilo nomba chasa ngo kutu fiyonse fiyonse wa dabo abantu wa mbiba lepa po kuti nomba emili mine ya chinja shani elo kwa riba pf tuwa fumine muma 2.6 million tons peye yetu walefu mwapo tuwalifisha over 3.6, 3.8 million tons per year. Tuwalefu mfia program ya a farmer input support program. Yo tuwetu fisi. Waka inde ichi lema, mwana mwini bavela, waisa tuwewo kuti awe, epo enene na mwishibudimi, na laisa na program iwe mepo, yetu le ito kuti kasi. Comprehensive agriculture support program. Yo program maponda mani, na wa minister of agriculture tabai shifo yungamba yo tuwalibe pushe mikuingi mparlamentu kutu mwenye nefwe mwenye tifisi po mwenye ifumia po na mwenye isa reduce ikasi pia la kutuwa la pantenshi ibo mbashani kanishi ama nensu wako sa mkanoa wako sa mkulanda ama speech haya kutubale sekesha wa mtu pamo ichibe vale wamba so iyo clip mwachitupela ya chila lango kuti awena zambia vali vali zo kuti vane kuli fiyonse fi mwanga leko lelu muyangala kubunga so ichime mbana wumfio kuti avena zambia pali kalakashita eva eve lumbu atinina walabe na avena zambia ichona wamuno kuti ubunga tawuli pali 50 kwa chai yo ngefe wabala hile ubunga wali kuma 400 eva la ndino kuti lumbu e ika pantofu watula hile tefio le chita yo elu kabili ichi kwa nka wachima na kuma mpalanya ama mpala nyavu nga pa 400 yao tuwa filwa. Ama futa ya pali 30 kwa cha tuwa filwa. Ama light load shading out of 24 hours, 21 hours tuwa filwa. Awena zambi walewa lumbu ya tika. Umuna kwa ifi. Tafia tala chitika po ifi. Nga mwa alipita mo. Aba chenzi la kunsa mshino na chila mwone ituleisa valeti. Vane mwone pali 3 hours per day. Nga mwa tamusha na 30 days. Yala mpela 90 hours. 90 hours mwiche divide by 24. Ile mpela nishu kushinga shita tuna half. So muli 30 days mwe shumo. We are only having power for 3 days. Papu nda mali. Tafia tala fistika po. Mupamba wako achivale. Uwa vena zambia watolele. Na tolo mupamba mzambia. Na mba mwene. Tekuti la ichila la tasha tala chihu wako mzambia yyo. Ina rindela nda pano. Na alipo chaya manuwa energy regulation board. Elo nchila wa MP. Tuwa lipo ni nune chila langi chichine. Ni mchila chila napu. Baet galungu ba muno kuti. Chairman IRB mwona. Ichalo. Ama businesses. Aya wa mfia malaiti. Avanto wa mfia malaiti. Wafulisha. Uku teke chalo. Chapu sana ukusita business. Tatupe nda profit mungu teke chalo. Pantu mungu wale kutu wati awe. Ama laiti kumoza mbiki ya koza po mutengo. Na mbaba nitu mjeno hospital yungo vale fwa. Kuteka shani kwa chaloko. What price tag are you putting on the life of a Zambia? As a government, tuwa tile, ifwe, ama light na mweko sali umutengo, pali 8 cents per kilowatt hour, tuwa lista import ku Mozambique. Awena zembe tuwa lewa pela pali 6 cents. Chinshi wantu wa chindi kwa mweo wa vantu. Avantu vale fwa mfipata ala lelo, vali vanga, umuna ndoka na kwa tama light. Ama businesses ya wilele elonia nga muna ndoka na pata maraiti. Abanto vale sansu wa kubaluani. Pantu waka wola wano mbale ingiri lafe. Kui ingiri lafe vaishi wakutu. Oh, ama maraiti na yaya. Kutu wafenga mati mitu nse vasenda. So kaishi, uvuka nkala wachalo. Na mwichala po chifilo kubomba uteko. Kuti ya lilaba ntu wachula. Elo wingi lapo. Uvu wafya tukwete. Tukwete wa businessman mu government. Vena fiyonse ni kakuleto kumono kuti. Oh, na mbe fia malaiti haya. Nga cha kutu wa shita kutu wa Mozambiki Kukala pangalose ya 2 cents per kilowatt hour Ukuteke chalo wa present we sute business yyo Pantu, avantu wa onaika, avantu wa afwa Ama businesses ya ya wa Nekimifia pitapo 
fiați la pogu și la pani de la ma, trebuie să se murice. So, ca și mobu e pitulet, going forward, as I wind up, va prezi dacă ai în decile, mă văd trebuie cu tine, va opozițion, muri la fie, te-am putut pe la mă soluțion. Ine, na va SG, na va forma ministra, na va campiongu, na mua aia cu parlament, muca mune ansa, muca sa înghe mua ansa de a parlament, muca ei sa sa înghe o cuti, tu am bine mă 2022, va prezi, stop exporting la existi. Tu am bine mă 2022, as opozițion, stop exporting la existi. Ulu ui vreau să stai exporti a mătau, tu am bine mă 2022, don't sell maize, a wani toca ciula. Fion se fi, te va le un fua, tu ai sanga mugu va fi. Mwewe na kawo. Ndefu ya mufwe, mufwe kishe. Ama fia tulimo le longe fia chilanda SG. Tuipa wile fio mulilo pa makasa. Venga wula kushitisha 1.5 milion tanzi ya mataba. Le lo hunga, niwite munga yiko wina. Ngata zuliana poison yo. Bantumumu wana iliwa shitisha 1.5 milion tanzi. Bale shita import 650 metric tanzi. Tewo fine, to try and stabilize. Which means, tuinga kwa to 1.5 yesu ya gya, na tulifia wina. Ma president daka inde ichilema. Bali inga filia, baisa sanga, jama ingi la mungu teko. Tulechita e power, maybe tulevo mfia po 2,000 megawatts. A prudent government, nga ba mwene working with meteorological department, 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 nga ba mwene working with We reduce our generation to below 2,000 megawatts. Le loama light load shedding inge ko hili, but maybe within two to three hours. That's how we manage our load shedding. So, kanshi, ila excuse ya kuti tule pita muli ifi mula ndu wa chila la aa, is irresponsibility and poor governance. O mula ndu wa kuti, hawa nensu, elo vaisa muu tekeshi, taba kwe tepo plani ine ine ya kuti venga teke chalo. Vaishi lefyo kuti, Venga ya fuilisha ma businesses ya wano kupange ndalama noko na ule chalo ngefo wano ule chalo. Kaishi mkwa hii icheva lumbu wati nina? Echeva lumbu wati ikaka. Habena zambe batile nina? Omla nduwa bunga. Na batila lumbu we ika munga kwa chilamo na fiwe ya chilamo. All right. Dear listeners, we wish to announce that the news bulletin na fungisho sapasu kama 12.30 Due to this sponsored program, uh, may be a little bit uh, delayed. But just about now, let's do the headlines so that was supposed to come at 12. Buzz and Labo News, 2 inch Club FM, at 7 30, 12 30 for the midday news, and 17 30 for the evening news. Club FM, the number one source for breaking news. This, this is Cloud FM News on top of the hour. Good afternoon, uh, the headlines at uh, 12. Uh, my name is Awason Kuyumari Mapondamadi. PF officials deny leaving the economy of the country in a bad state and accuse the UPN administration of mismanaging the economy. HH asked World Bank Group uh, to take uh, necessary steps to, to help uh, countries like Zambia avoid going into economic shutdown. And opposition citizens first uh, launches a party manifesto. Government commended for constructing uh, palaces uh, for cheers. In international news, uh, floods uh, in uh, northeastern Nigeria affect one million people. Sports news, uh, TP Mazembe arriving in Dola ahead of uh, Champions uh, League tie against uh, Red Arrows. Uh, this and uh, many other stories are in the midday bulletin that will come uh, at a rescheduled time. Thank you very much. Uh, the PFR sponsored program continues and I will soon be opening the phone lines uh, so that uh, callers can participate. Good afternoon. <laughs> I've okay, seen uh, the phone buzzing time after time, but just uh, uh, just hold on a little bit. Uh, the program has been adjusted, so we'll go slightly long, longer than the 12.30. So, uh, before we open the phone line, Honorable uh, Kampiongo, you wish to come in? Mureti president, mureti kansela. Ama improya zivesu vantu. Nero tuwa kuvantu, echa utuwa pela fila yo, fia mibombele. Iyo kilipu mwachila muna pachipe chintu wingi, pali chini dangombe wa vantu. For example, 1,500, ukuamba mjanuari. Suga, umutengo wa chinja po imiku inga, na ngu imiku isano. Ama futa ya kubika mumu na nikuki hoyo ya chinja po imiku inga, dimbini teni. 
Kansi na ngufenya wabe ni haba bonsi wa mchobo Akabunga kasa kakabunga mkona ya nganda Awe ni nishina piba Echi ule mwono mtu wale nda pamuse wo Uta ile nila limbitare umfwa Na no, umechi vipishe chicha chukumi yako muna ndi chakutila Mweba ntunga mamona maraiti Wana nari weka waka Elo nomba waisa umfwa atiba elected commission of Zambia Ababa chitama ma, ufia kusala Babula ama generator seat Tuotuma generator mwono mwono 1500 Watu wala kumalawi Yotu wa shimekuwa bena Malawi. Avantu wezi wale chula muno mwonsi mwune fwai kwa ma jeneleta. Na muno mwine mwune 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 konda mali mwune fwai kwa ka jeneleta. No mba wuto ntu nkanyo wa msa ngoshati. Fiafi netu wale vevo kutila mwishishi ya mataba ya avantu. Mutu wale kuchalo chimbi. Avantu waka ponenu wale nsala. Ichika chika chika vipa. Valeti yo ma politics. Tule tafa ma politics. Le lo tulipano. Fiafi tila tafa ula na rekweva. Kansi. Ifi. Evo tulefu uteko. Uteko. Muna nda chati lechu kwa nkabaji mwena kuma mparanya. How can you describe a government who decides to give away generator sets? Electoral Commission of Zambia. 1,500 to one Yes, helping your neighbor is when you are okay. You can't get what you have remained with to feed your children to give your neighbor. You are a poor parent. So how can you take generator sets to Malawi to go and help them for voter registration? We need voter registration here. So that our employers can be registered, our employers can decide who should take the, them forward, who should finish their problems properly, who should fix their challenges properly. That's the recklessness of the Electoral Commission of Zambia. And if you haven't sent those generator sets, turn them back so that you can either give them to the clinics in the meantime, so that those clinics which, who, that are struggling without power can utilize those generator sets and you can get them. When time is okay. These are proposals that we are giving you because we don't want to just be talking. Give people fertilizer now before the rain season. Where, they are, where we have rains starting from central province, northern, Muchinga, eastern province, and northwestern province. Make sure that you take fertilizer in good numbers. Not people should be sharing meda. Then you come and say, oh, we gave you fertilizer in meda. If you don't sell 10, pack, uh, 10 bags of maize, you won't get inputs next year. Who are you punishing? You are just punishing yourselves by government. Ero le kenina avantu vale ilandila. Panu pamila wasa mkwete mule unfu avantu ufu vale ilanda wa ponda mali. Pantu avantu eva le unfu unfu kufina kwa mchele untu wa sendero mkushimila pa mchele pa mtue. Na mweva avu teko. Le kenu kutitikisha avantu nga vale mweva kwe fintu ufu file chitika. Avantu chimone ifilo la mira. When the mira shows you what you, the, your hair is record, you comb the hair, you don't break the rim mira. So, tule lomba kwa, awawa kwa ta msa msa kula nita kwa wanavu, ukutuma kutuma rejo, wa PS kuhumfwa, elu mwambo kuta address ama issues, wa DC, wa umfwa, what is troubling the people? Ebu tungulushi, tebutia yo, yo mwewa tuma mafoni mwanya, mwewa tuma mafoni, we are going to arrest you. Ala umuntu, e hey, mploya wenu, muka mfuwaya, ni mailo. Alright, let's speak our caller, hello. Good morning. Uh, good afternoon. <laughs>
Please, let's try to be brief so that we can take as many callers as possible. And the panelists take note of the concerts that are coming in, then I'll give you time to respond to them. Hello. Hello, good afternoon, Mapondamari. Good afternoon, Munishan Mkwai. We would like soldier on our list, but let me not go from extension. Well, anyway, soldier, Mkwang Fian, just a minute, please.
So maybe you, can, you wish to react to some of those before you pick another set of calls. Yeah, thank you very much. I think uh, most of the calls are basically words of encouragement. Very to Kosalesha, but what do you mean? I am Toro Lede. Come by, what's about when I can't engage in my value of Kuberek? We and Dashiwaka could let the child. I think mine is to react for Natural. The issues of PF. Mausamba and the rest of the issues that are worrying the Zambian people. We want to assure you. Trefoku Kuminaya Kutina solutions around those problems are underway. Namushiwa if you let they have gotten a bit confused by certain offers and situations. They have realized that they are betraying the Zambian people. And to that effect, like I said, we're going to deploy every divine wisdom at our disposal to resolve those issues. Because we know that that we are doing on behalf of the Zambian people. Uh, but beyond that, PF is also a people's political party, pro poor. The real solution is not churches in our UPND. UPND they are kaleke kufua yako na ola PF. A program wa kuata. A survival tool wa kuete. They want to break ono bokampiongo. Mwalema mono fuba yishiro kuchita kuchinsali. You know, in Shwangandu, when they try to prosecute it, he's been going to court. I have, like I've said, over 20 cases. And there are many others. Our friends are, in, you know, in prison. But when you examine most of these cases that are lumped on, you know, leaders of patriotic front, they are all aimed at feeding into propaganda, but also to break the spirit of the leadership and the membership of patriotic front. But God has been gracious, in the sense that once MPF, we are resilient and have remained strong. Ichile pakushaka inde chile na chile nangu kwa telefiro kula ala. Chakutira, amu ene kwa nti, eh, after the loss in 2021, PF would disintegrate. Numba, taishu wakutira, katuishi chumu pashiwa sata basha mu PF, ba edika na mela walunda. PF can be very deceitful in the sense that, kutule muna kato leta rikishanyi, uivi nitu waikata na mashati, but the bond among ourselves is so strong that to disintegrate is impossible. And the everybody knows that. So that we to all put our sister ni. Tawitika. 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 We are determined on behalf of the Zambian people, first of all, to inculcate and continue to pursue unity of purpose, coupled with the resolve of the Zambian people to work with us to remove this government. It doesn't matter the shenanigans of Waka in the the people's will will prevail, and PF is the platform. Right. And we will not allow this platform to be destroyed or to disintegrate by whatever means deployed by our enemies. We will stand with the Zambian people. That's the assurance I can give. We are ready to make sure that uh, all little things within the party that may be encumbrances are sorted out so that the collective will of patriotic front coupled with the resolve of the Zambian people delivers in 2026. All right. That's the commitment we make. All right. Let's speak uh, just uh, some more calls. Hello. Yes, my friend. Okay, twenty then confirmed. Just a Okay, 
Kanti matama kamuno muka kwe mwaba kwa tintu ngurisa kwa tesha yu CND Kwa tinikome jipe shpanga Kanti shandichi Mairo shaita alandichi Kapavi kishinge pe kumfu wapo So leno ringu kwa kwa tino kumfu wa Ipishinka kuli mwenye 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 Iko tukisanga kwa weku tapatio wala ile Tapatio asuka wino Ile leno ringu na wanja asuka kwa tino wotata ni Video na chila ipu chakuri wa mawa emu kwa 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 kwa
Let's pick uh, one more call so that the panelists are able to uh, are able to respond uh, to to, uh, to the concerns that have been raised. Zero seven seven zero 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 nine six seven. Let's pick this call and then we can uh, respond. Hello. Hello. Mabuka 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 Baba Kelvin in Talasha from Tambula to which they want to Moto and Kova Kanti and Gova Nakachinda, Ramundo Vini. Falumba Manu Madiba the Mabuka Venugo, Tabuka Matuka, Tabutambula, Punukuka Way, Talumba Emane. Ah, Vaponda Mari? Duna. Responded to the concerns. Uh, from Muntalasha, he was talking about uh, he was talking about uh, the cadres uh, that existed in the PF, where the to the extent where they were burning money. Uh, was that good to you? And he also asked about uh, the farmers that uh, you allegedly left not uh, paid. Uh, that uh, was that uh, good to you? And also the retirees and the rest of the conversations. I think uh, you heard uh, for yourselves. So let us respond to this. Maybe for us to be a little structured in responding since there were many callers. Honorable uh, Mundevi, they will deal with the dual carriage way, you know, and, and just, you know, present the facts around the scandal over this dual carriage way. All right. The intent that we had as PF and what has been done. All right. Uh, it will even touch the issue of pension money because uh, basically the pension money has been, you know, rooted. Okay. Honorable Campion will come and deal with uh, obviously issues of electricity and some of these concerns that are raised in the course yeah, of Then we pick the last set of calls. And then I'll deal with the party and uh, issues to do with cadres because obviously it falls uh, around uh, my jurisdiction. Honorable Mundi. Right. Thank you. Thank, thank you very much. And um, very quickly, around about 2015, the government rolled out uh, projects PPP. Among them was the dollar, the carriageway, the capital portion, the 
Lusaka, Kafe, Chirundu, uh, and many others. And uh, when the contractors came on site and did a feasibility study, they realized that the only road which could mm -hmm. give a good return on investment was in Dollar Due Carriageway. Uh, the reimposition upon the failed, the traffic volumes were not enough to recover. It required government subsidy. It was that a $2 billion project. So as a result of that, uh, looking at the traffic, uh, in uh, the PF government, we undertook projects under what we called uh, an integrated multi-sectoral approach, meaning that uh, a number of sectors coming together to uh, you know, achieve one objective. So you remember, uh, if I take you back uh, briefly, that uh, uh, President Lungu prioritized the construction of the Chingola Solwezi Road because those, uh, the northwestern province was an emerging copper belt province. So the Chingola Solwezi Road was prioritized. Uh, the Kafue mm -hmm. Tanpak Mazabuka Road was prioritized. But then there was still congestion on other roads. So mm -hmm. the dual carriageway was agent. It needed to be done. So government looked around and found the contractor, a China Jiangxi. China Jiangxi was ready to do the uh, dual <coughs> carriageway at a cost of $1.2 billion. At this cost, one, uh, this loan from the Chinese uh, banks through China Jiangxi onto the Ndola dual carriageway was supposed to be repaid within 15 years. Now, if you look at the scope of works within that 1.2 billion, for instance, in Kabwe alone, uh, Kabwe was supposed to receive an additional 20 kilometers of township roads in addition to the dual carriageway. And the towns along the way, like Kapiri, also another 20 kilometers until you go to Ndora. So when our friends came into government, first of all, they condemned the cost. Uh, 1.2 billion was too much. They went out and uh, tendered out works to find uh, a contractor to do these works. So the first thing that contractor did, they reduced the scope. They reduced the scope of works from the, what was in the 1.2 billion. Kawe will no longer receive the 20 kilometers that was in the initial uh, project. Kapiri will not. The road between um, Kafulafuta into Rwanda was supposed to be a dual carriageway. It will not be. So firstly, there was a reduction in the scope of works along that road, which automatically dropped the prices. Now, I want you to focus and see where the scandal lies. The 15 years within which uh, the loan repayment was supposed to be made, the Zambian government was going to continue running the toll gates, get money from the toll gates and pay uh, the contractor and pay the loan back of 1.2 billion and remain enjoying the proceeds from the stories. Now, the scandal that you have today uh, is that you have a, a contractor, a consortium, uh, saying they will build this project for $650 million. And uh, the UPND government is contrasting it with the initial 1.2. So they are saying we'll build the pro we'll build the road at six hundred and fifty million dollars, and the UPND leaders, UPND supporters, go all out to insult PF that PF value for who went down with dual carriageway. So now, in addition to the six hundred and fifty uh, uh, million dollars, the concessionaire takes over the toll gates for a period of twenty five years. Now, I want you to sit back and do your mathematics. Get the statistics, go to Google, go wherever, get the mathematics. You will discover that over a period of 25 years, these targets are going to generate in excess of $2.6 billion. So when you get that $2.6 billion, you add the $650 million. The cost of the dollar deal carriage is actually $3.3 over $3.3 billion under the UPND. Mm. Under the PF that they condemned, 1.2, we control the toll gates. We repay the loan in 15 years, and thereafter, the rest is our business. So the scandal that there is now, they've only shown you one face. They showed me the 650. They have not told the Zambian people 
the reduction in the scope of works along this particular project. They have also not told the Zambian people the value of the foregone revenue uh, on these targets. So, uh, in summary, if you look at the Chingola Solwezi Road, Chingola Solwezi Road was financed by NAPSA. NAPSA gave money to National Fund Agency. Mm. No, National Fund Agency found three contractors and built that road. The Kitwe, Solwezi, the Kitwe Chingola was built under the same model. Mm. Now, I want to ask one question to the Zambian people. What sense does that make? What wisdom is there? In the Lama Shia, NAPSA. We used this model before. We are sending them to the NAPSA to appeal our national road fund agency. It's all government. Every single contractor, every one of the Lama targets could develop the contractor. To let them at Ocean, the Pacific and Ocean Consortium. We are Ocean Consortium. Talondo weke, tafilondo weke. We know, we know. Raw aquate. Contractor Avike ko ina China Railway. Why didn't NAPSA? and workman compensation give the money to national fund agency as they did in the Chingola Solwezi. Elo balabantu wa sanga nomba baleta baleta avik na China Railway. What is the role of that consortium? Tuwa isa munga ndamu mienu. Tuwa sanga first born wenu ali kwa tako business ali kwa tako nenda lama. Inenga ini na isa isa to nene mumu ndiwile consortium. Na isa se nenda lama waponda mali. Kuli first born wenu. Teo fine. No gusa kulengan, gano kumitamche munga nda mumi yinu muleika na mwono kulapo karenti. Na panga extension kunga nda mumi kalamo na mitamche na mwonze na mwono kulapo karenti. That is taking Zambian for granted. He, diu ya, diu carriage way, is pure theft. Nibuka wa wapilako, wapeleke shako. Any government, he case after 2026, there is no government that can sustain that particular contract. In a contract here, dual carriage way is needed. We need that dual carriage way. But it must be done properly and within cost. What we have is a scandal. Is a scandal of that road costing 3.3 billion, money taken away from the Zambian people, targets taken away from the Zambian people, people losing jobs and people losing business. <clears throat> As we look at that dual carriage way, you should understand that it is a scandal. Na so tele chine chine, mkai kairi kutasha shiba kumpa wa suwonsa wa chisanga wa basinda monu wali wa kikwa king cobra Kumakululu wa iti soja kunkuruma wa shevela wa chalwe wa chalwe kaume Wa kukawa makulia wa chwe devi wa ntara sha kelvin na wa jeno chongo Mkusupa wii lafi mkwa suka guli kimotu motu wa chukumi yako Mm -hmm. Bajen uh, King Cobra, ndi mlomba fi ukucha na wale mfabonse, ukuti la chine chine, ichupo ni sansa. Eee, hey, panga ndanga paisa machushi, pala bobo wafia. Kutuwe shitato ule shunguru kama tontonga, nyo pakutu vike chakule panga nda, chala lito wafia. Kaishitule mlomba kwa fiumwe wa shitata, ukuta mbe ni mitime ya shipa. Fila fila tutila, ngana maibu kisa fila fila mba, uh, umuya shi, eh, eh, pike chala. Waleti ichupo ni sansa. Nangu fishu pesha ni kushipa fie. Kaisi kumi lomba fia kutila. Mwe wa ntuwa kwa lesa. Nelo wafia kwa isa pama ya nda. Tufile tuwa mwono kutila. Tuwa ika lava shipikisha. Vana mayo mwule ituko selesha kufwe wa shitata. Nga wa shunguru kwa wa shunguru kwa wawela fie minu wa nkutua. Mwa tuko selesha kutila. Shukuru ala lesa ala pala mwa ala sange chakulia. Chakuti mutule tele. Ngo mtu wa kwa takwa mano ya abuela. Bantu kutimu alefu mapanga ndana mfuruwa na mpusha, ale ndapa musebo moto kaya mwalangula, kai mwashala fie mweka. Kanshi nero kuli uchushi, tuikatani. Mwachila ndapaja shiri ya magasin. Chine chine yama, takuwa wubu teko uwe ingate moku leku kuchusha bantu ule teka. Nishubu teko usha kwa tamano. Fila fia chitike, fia chimfuru nga jacha gasin, Na ale isa lionse na mparamenti na alandanga chilolo wali angali la kumutende wa chalo Epo abantu wale ndela Na waka pokola babo mba Bali bombele chine chine Ukumono kutila Chila chintu cha bombele wapo Umutende wa chashani Wawwe la mchalo Na abantu wawengi wali ketwe Wamba nukwe ya pufigifia milando Lerwe cha chitika 
Echo mungala ipusha. Ukutia kushibu wale wale ina kuchile cha mina nduwa ikete waka pokola. Hawa isangiru muli ila mi, 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 misango ya vipa. Ya kula epe wika wanti muka yofi. Chishi. Pantu ndokuti maisa asanga pali abobe ni. Bali swang, bali chita manole. Umula nduro wakutia wai mini kafeo wakulo kupuisha munga muma koti. Nole. Di mbeba apuka nenda lama ishishi dewa leti ya wali fula nenda lama. Umutu ta ulapita mche ta mula ndu wakusa ngu kutia tapali umula ndu kwete. Batila wafuma muna ole. Pantinole. Kutilo yumula ndu. Di mbe kutu waisa abu ukuluka. Ngavu nga wakwa chechete mula ndu wakuna kutia pali fishen kafimbi. Kaiste tu umutu wafole lepo nenda lama hiyo. Eti natu nena ndu kutile chi. Chili ngo upupu. Uwa kutia mwala fule shenda lama wantu. Imila ndu ta ilapo mfile fiamu ya ne fiamu ya ne fiamu ya ne fiamu ya ne Tetu uteko uwike abantu muka yofi. Waka pokola wali bombele. Waikata na abantu wabengi. Haba lea kumakoti. Kwa lili jadiashi. Lelo. Echo mingala ipusha kutia chinshi chachitika. Elo e, kwa kuchinja kwa uteko. Pali bala abantu wale chita ifyavi. Vaisi soja vaisi tuwa pa, pa masora paneo. China china masora paneo baka teka wale chita shiteni. Eee. Hey, no mbama kwa ito lupia wakusha masora paneo. Ni banga. Na mbufi wa wafi wa wafi wa uteko, ni wanga waka pokola, ni wanga wa collection service officer, ni wanga waka fundisha, ni wanga waka nesi. Awe nga kwanisha, awe lefi loku kwanisha huku wiki efi wakule panganda. Nechama friji nomba ale nunga nga wamochari kukana kwa tama right. Kutu mtu wale shito tumu na nyamika kumulika friji, ukutia tuwala niti ntakopa milungu hivini, nombo lwa kukana kwa tama right. Chine chine, if you want to know. Tama kwe tenda lama. Nomba nda lama shakutiwa shite wa zola pano ya afuma kwe. Ichiba leta wakateka kutitu wa walombo kutilanga Baisa hafunya po ichiba tila wa joe mapping Ichiba leta indike shakulo Ichiba leta shakulo sabante chalo chonse Shimoni hapa wa memi kuwa Shimoni hapa wa meshi Bale po saponi nila mai amakana na amakana 1 million dollars Bachi mini kechidi ya Bachi tile kwa wantu ama sora panel Baya kutia wantu ya wafweko Mubu chushi balimo Ema, ema no tulewa panda ko Elo nga tulewa panda ko ifita wale umfwa Luavo Epo chile shupa Kaisi fimbi wa shawela na wasuka kwa wanandi Wa charo wa chati la komedi Ala komedi chima na financhando kutila huku wepe mbwa umusheto Alo mtu nga lina kari haka mtu kwa mtu mkolo Katufpiki kwa mtu ya katufpiki techalande Techalande le kwa wandu Umutu nga na ikuta asonti lo waliku kukanua Kaisi awa wa prezi sina wale kwa ta kutu nda lama muli wa maini Tuwale mwana wa na nomba li nechile chitika huku wasuka kwa shawela Ni muna muka wewe mtu wale muna wakada wa ino ishita Awa wale ishita ishita tumi 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 wawa kwete kwe shukoli yako ya mtu mwa maini Bale ya kanenda lami mimi fufwa mwili wa motoka Ni muna ini ino ishita Mute kwa UPND Avanti wale chula nesala mwa kululu Avanti wale chula nesala mwa kawa momo Bale ya kanenda lama Bale fi mpoko tuwefi Leronga waisa ya kilapati ni mbapano Baka lama mwa tifintu filibu ino Pantu wena wale itashani Bale liya E yoko me dimachila alanda po. Kairi washa ula maisa atila yo wakada chine chine wa SG wala apu ishishisha. Ichoto wadisu mine kuti echa wakada wala wale ite fiwa kushuru wambitu wale wekata na uku wekata. Tachawe me kaita chue mena ino ine nishita. Ushe wala wakada wa ile puma wa kansela muu kushi. Wa kansela wale sara deputy mayor. Awa UPN duku ya puma na wa kansela wako. Nishimati ya kadarizi mwe alipua. Nimuno wakada wale pepeka. Ukula pepeka na wafuma president wa Edgar Lungu. Ukuta tuwa mpepeka afuma. Na wakateka walipo. Waka wafuma president. Umuchi nshi ufile wa wapo. Ife wakateka watu walijani wakateka. Tama wakawala mungu wapo na nguna tuisa pano pafili mbatu watila. Yo, waeche chite wakateka. Kuchitu walanda pafi wafili woku bomba. Lelote chitu wapele umusalu la iyo. Nero waka fuma po. Chika vachimochini. So kanshi chama wachila landa wa shikuru wantu. Ukuta wa shima famu tawa folele ndalama. Ebu fi. Pantu wa shima famu wonse ba yifole mu 2021. Fino ndela nda wa shima famu mwale chila mkala baka la ishite ndala mama kashi. Nanu mbabe nita wala fole ndala mama. Evo tuingala ala ndapo. Ifwe tuwalele tu mfundo ishite ya linga. Tuwalingilo kulu ndapo. Efe batula hile. Ukutia baka ndapo. Icho chisha chitika. Kanshi. Wa. 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 Devi chibwe batula ndapo ma free news. E chine chine. E chine fwa yuwa ilo ishita. Kulo nisha. E kwa li ama kada ifu tuwa lisumina chari wipile. Na luno wine chachweme. Pantu nama kanda zimene. Eko bachiri. So chotu ya ndafi chakutila. Uu teko. Na bubombe milimo. Avanti wale kwa techa kulia. Ngo mwachala ndila chwe. Insala. 
ni mji minwa kairi sala ila leto muse vanya fwe wa shitata ngorefu kuhike cha kuja panganda ala muse vanyo ubi e uchile ngokuwa tuenda awantu nemi tona usulola kashi ichi e wafya tukwete bajeno chongo na mula ndapa misepela I misepela ii na ya wikilo uteko mula eloresha chichi balese ngamu musepela waisa ima weme ni tuafwe nsala ama la ita tukwe te tatureso mafwe wa jima skulu haya imi nafipa freedom statue parana waka inde vayi mini ine uyo mwalonga ukumulo nge miringu itatu ache pesho mwa ichena wawadi ya papa sg hawa lala kuhu imieshi ne mieshi mchifungo papula nda kufi mwema ntua chumuledo wa wunga wa 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 poison wena wa shipako ako wa ile senda kai cheka musepela kai mafe kewe ni kwena nifotu wa naka fwe wa votele fwe wa imine ka chelo chelo ushete chumulo leshe kupali ya mafe tube pitamo kanshi efe tule landa wa shevela ayana na unfwa icha makada chari wipide lero mfuro mwa ishiwa nga mwala mwana wa patiri bala koma ila pafintu mwle wa tuka na nomba wa chilibale itukwa umupati shishikofu wesu aisa ito urusifa no wakukani ya kota pati dia ba yu ni baisa tila mwe chalo cha zambia tuwa ama fundi tamule tamule loe sha ee wuntu mwa wawa ntu wino wino mwalati yo baisa ba ni mkuno wa kateka baisha mkuno wa shikofu muno mkabwe shikofu mkalamba mufi ashika chema mkalamba wa ekresha katolika bali na meeting kulia meeting wa yapas ama nishu kwe kalakwa shani kuma kuru kwa mwene na ndati kuli nsala atule mfuna kuna mwene susidi ni mshanga ye mpi wenu uruse pantu kwena izala ya lapo na mwakula mwene kwa chini mwene mpi ala chila nukweza mungu mpempura pantu ni mwene kwa chisa mungu mpempura wanju waiza za nge izala haku pesha mwene kutu wafu ilishe kashi mwene kwa selisha kwe ntunguru shienu sidi nabu mkwete mkonstituensi ya bo bale mkutia chiti chitendo na chifi na Lero kuba fashi wesu mwe ba patiri mwe ba mwe ba ngakwa tesho kwa kuno fira ko ifo tibi ba aba istika okumilangira ko ifo enero ture kala pa ture milangira ko nicho na tisho kutanga to akano kula milangira ko taba kamunfo yo eto mole mwana nangwa aba bana ka chinda ba fomo chifungo aba ne nsulo ero ali mu chifungo ba chitotela na ba chilangwa ama constituency yabo tapali aba rebe minina ko nga watulele che ba chilangwa mu ne nsu fira mutya disabled ichilema Uu shiti ya nukutila yoo ineko mamu ampela kufi pampa mbale nchi ni bichilema Ala liwi shoku imini na kwa bantu tuwa ishilena kwa mtuwe chileven yolo tuwa lesa na basata Na ilo wachili ni mpi Ya umule talantansha Muku la nita kufi abantu na muku ipantu kwenye nika hulu hulu mu shiti na uye zori ya nkoko Le ilo tulewa sari kila koko Tila fila fina wale chuchu tika mudia Uu shiru ila mutembo wa muna nkwe No wankwe upo kwa Ifwewe ene Mkula nda kwa liye nse mfine tukoma ilapu efi Ala fila Fila batina Dero mafuro kula bombana ifu Paputa tulebe wako Batina Uwa uwele Tashika Pa ntufo tu wali bomba puwe minimo ya buteko Kutu wa mwema kwa kutila Pa mwa ikata hapa Mito lilo vovo Mwala leitele la bantu Na fila fina tumwema kwa liye nse Alright Maybe before you come in Honor wana kachinda We are running short of time Honor wana mundo bila you can make Just as a few observations Kwa zinu max In just about two minutes then the secretary general and eligibility will, yeah eligibility issues the right. secretary general will make his remarks and then eventually uh, close up we're getting into another program thank you very much uh, th thank you very much um there was a question to do with eligibility so i think that the sg addressed it uh, mm -hmm. uh, comprehensively yeah, that matter was uh, uh, taken to court three times and the court uh, uh, ruled that uh, President Moon was eligible, mm -hmm. and that's the reason why he was able to stand in 2021. However, in um, very unusual circumstances, mm -hmm. even when the court, court is a court of finality, uh, they entertained an application, yet another application from uh, some citizen who still went to question the eligibility of the President. As a party, uh, we stand by the earlier judgment. Three a judgment that came to the Com Court, which were that President Lungu was eligible. Even as we go through this process, we remain confident mm -hmm. because we don't believe that the court will depart from its own decision. So that's what I can say about that eligibility. Right. Yes. So as uh, well, for my remaining one minute, uh, yes, I think for uh, for me, it's just uh, some advice to government. Mm -hmm. and when we talk about uh, food security, we remove politics. Uh, we are already in the rainy season now 
uh, let the president and his government forget about CASIP. In a CASIP, it will never work. What we want to say to them is that um, they should deploy their provincial agricultural coordinators to ascertain the farmers that um, the registered farmers in various districts, especially in areas where there's good rainfall. Let them establish how many farmers we have in Wapula, how many farmers we have in Northern, uh, Muchinga, and the uh, Eastern Province. Mm -hmm. These areas uh, are not uh, prone to uh, uh, droughts. Uh, thereafter, they properly allocate Bale Kefia Kupela Fertilizer, Muma Meda, Kawe Kapiri, and these other areas, part of Central Province, Mufla Lalo Cafe Wino, Mupela Ban Fertilizer, Muma Meda, Kuri Mufla Loka Wino. Uh, so that ultimately we can start going over 3 million uh, tons going forward. So the government, through your provincial agricultural coordinators, then establish number of shibulimi. Uh, every district, not all of them access inputs. Lay low, uh, for the sake of um, uh, transitioning through these, these trouble times, mwone nyu kutumu apela mufundo wino. Ichile ngele maka maka mwewe kalacharo. Ela tuwalea nana wa msokotuwa ne power flow of the house. Wa msokotuwa ne vaishile mkusef ya ukuti na basa ina IMF deal. Tuwalimine mparlament no kubewa ukuti iyo mwasa ina chibu kwa tuwaisa ina death sentence yesu. Ifwe tuwaisa negotiate IMF deal as uh, PF. Walianga ndu ali kuhishia nina wa IMF. Vaisa pusana pa fintu fita tu. Number one ni reduced a quantum of support to agricultural sector. Number two, issue ya energy sector. Ya kwete component ya malaiti na ya fuel. Wa msoko tuwane batile. Kiyo nse mkua mkua na IMF. Lelo pali fifita tu. Na kifilo kusumi na pantu. Fikesa onau lukwika shu wabena Zambia. Gamulewe kukisha ponda mali. Pa parliament, mparlament, wabebe di okuti. Iyo mwa sai na IMF in the form you have signed it. Na ifu inga tuwalefu wa yanga tuwalisaine. Tuwalike nyo kusaine fio. Pantu we propu wa pate tuwalisaka mana wena Zambia. Kama saini fio, kwa la wa problem mubuli mi. Tabafu ayo kulanda, what the issue is on fertilizer, they are slowly phasing out support to agriculture sector. Not long from now, government will not be supporting the agriculture sector. Mm -hmm. We have already seen those measures in the energy sector, increase in the connection fees and tariffs, uh, including the fuel. A fint tuwa kene funga ba PF, tuwa leti, wa an emerging economy, wa a growing economy, the Kenya one two, Vachibale and Fula, Amena Zambia, Ichalo Chikuleko. So I am mafia to let Peter not accidental. They signed for this, they knew this would happen. Why? Because it's a government that does not really care for the poor. It's not a pro poor government as, uh, as compared to the PF. All right. So, uh, the Honorable Nakachine are coming in to close, but just before you close, uh, there's a person that uh, was with us here, uh, Honorable Richard uh, Musukwa. Just turn the microphone, just uh, just for about a minute, and uh, uh, Thank you, thank you very much, Mwanangwa. Really appreciated, and uh, you know I was standing on the shoulders of giants, and I allowed them to articulate issues across board, and I'm very glad that they have done so, for the benefit of the people of Kawe and Central Province. I want to state very clearly that where we are under the uh, UPND government, the Zambian economic trajectory has lamentably uh, collapsed. And that no amount of help from, from World Bank, IMF, we will resuscitate the fortunes of our country. What we require is that Zambia's economy, which is in the doldrum, can only be revived by resilience, the resilience that's uh, anchored by uh, President Edgar Lungu, who has teams such as Mundubile, Kampiongo, and we also have young Takis who have come along, like uh, Kapianga, and so on, who are able to propel and transform our country to greater heights. I think that PF has gone through the meal, and we have learned our shortcomings, and we are prepared to ensure that we change the trajectory of our country. I will not uh, stop by insisting that Zambia's uh, uh, um, uh, mineral resources mm -hmm. continue to remain Zambia's comparative advantage and is anchored by ensuring that our youths and women take center stage, especially local people, in participation in the exploitation of our mineral resources. Right. And that's the thrust of the PF government. Thank you. Much appreciated. Uh, SJ, as you end up just in about under five minutes, thank you very much. I'm sure you've seen the quality of uh, 
human resource and the government. The government is the fact that we are not going to be able to do it. We are not going to be able to do it. We are not going to be able to do it. We are not going to be able to do it. We are not going to be able to do it. We are not going to be able to do it. We are not going to be able to do it. We are not going to be able to do it. Continuously, I will report what I said to Kenya Malosis. The day the Zambian people were given an opportunity to run that mine, it was posting profit, paying you know, you know, contractors, paying the workers, no areas, dismantling the data like that. That a mine in Omba Shitisha, Kumundu Shaishi, we cannot go to Shibaka to buy. So, my two of which we are ready to govern anytime. Honorable Mundubile has clarified. President Nungu is eligible to stand. That action in the Concord is an indirect way of petitioning the election of 2021. If President Nungu is declared ineligible, you know what that means? It means the elections of 2021 are null and void. Waka in the Makulonga, Nokia Kuisa, Uwengwa, Barungu, Wabu, Ramstead, our fresh elections, and those who are eligible are just able to participate. But we should a decision because of the provisions of the Constitution. I'm a minister of the office after the resolution of 2016. But when we go to your decision of the office is not an void. When we go to the office, we go to the office, we go to the office, from the time that illegal quote unquote decision was made for them to stay in office. Whatever the other ministers, what did it be in the Rama? Shon Sushuba Pokerama says. So meaning that with that precedence, Mizaka in the HM as the salaries that he has gotten in the last three years needs to be refunded. I'm a minister's bonds. All the appointments he makes, it is actually a threat to national security because that outfit will be difficult to deal with. UPND must get it in their head and heads that if they are to compete to deal with President Lungu, they can only deal with him in the ballot. They up their game of politics in terms of fulfilling the promises. There is no other way. You can't use n hundred methods. They are also doing what they have launched what they are calling you know operational June twenty twenty five. They are hoping that if we, because they are beginning to lose hope about the case in the Concord, they are beginning to orchestrate an agenda to try and force Aka Indejirema to go to Parliament, mm -hmm. including this unexpected the opening of uh, Parliament, that possibly he can hint, or if not, gather courage and move a motion to say, can we consider removing the immunity of who? President Lungu? Because they are thinking that they can speed up you know, mm -hmm. concoct some cases against him, speed up the process through the court to have him convicted with the hope that they'll stop him. <laughs> I can tell you, every effort they make towards injuring President Lungu and try and disfranchise him, they are basically just angering the Zambian people. And the examples in Brazil, they attempted a president emerged from prison and went to state house. There are many examples globally. We can only advise them. If you want a legacy of having left at this peaceful country. Don't go that route. Leave President Lungu alone. Unfortunately, when somebody is graced, there's nothing you can do about it. You can't stop it. <laughs> Even when you don't like it, there's nothing you can do about it. Just up your game. There was uh, my brother who was speaking in Nenji. Wamba uh, Makadas, on Campion Kampi has already stated. We didn't need to wait for people to rub it in our face. Just after the loss, we launched and put up a committee to go and interrogate the Zambian people to tell us why with this development of the delivered, how could you make a decision of that nature to get us out of government? They said in terms of development, we are fantastic. In terms of governance, we are fantastic. The only thing that has gotten us irritated to this level and we made an emotional decision is the conduct of your, your cadres. But I can tell you that mm -hmm. even the, the so-called uh, cadre behavior, it was more out of provocation from the UPND. The most violent political party in this country is the UPND. They are the ones who have Mapatiza formula and all other formulas. What they were doing in opposition, 
by UPNDs that they deliberately came up with the, a disruptive method. If, for example, uh, they are, one of their leaders is going to, to the police, they will carry weapons to go and fight with the police. And when the police react in self-defense and also making sure there is peace, then they take pictures and present there that the police are being brought. That was the scheme of the UPND. They will be provocative, deliberately. Why is it that we are in opposition today? Our activities, are, and there have never been any violent activities you know, in everything that we do, unless the UPND come to confront us. So yes, there is an issue of cadres because ama cadres we su gamela wa isachiram gavate mwasa ana when for example we are launching a, a, you know a flower bridge instead of celebrating in a you know yes there is development wa kula enda mutauni wale shunguru kandi inconvenience in you know traffic mm. that is basically the scene that they were committing they were getting over excited mind you we also had the, a, a deliberate policy to empower, you know, citizens uh, 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 by a policy that was introduced that when it comes to any contract that involves a foreigner, 20% must be given to Zambians. Some of the people who were getting money and displaying were not even PF cutters. We are just people out of the goodwill of wanting to empower Zambians. Now, you can't guarantee how somebody will behave when for the first time in their life, Pastor Kwataku Kangwe, you understand? The, the empowerment program was not banned, but you can't guarantee how somebody will behave when they have 200,000 kwach. Some of them kumuna kwati lupia sana, wasenda kubaka pomba, wamba no to try and show off. We still needed a process to start educating our citizens that the empowerment program is not meant for you to get crazy. It's meant for you to be able to create wealth for your family for the next generation. That way is what we're working on, and we may be condemned for it. But as I close, I want to appeal as to the close, my program director is telling me to close, yeah. Appeal to the Zambian people. There is only one assignment we all have. PF, we consider ourselves just vessels on your behalf. Your assignment is to insist that nothing wrong is permitted for the UPND to do to disfranchise them from expressing themselves clearly about what they want, they want to happen in 2026. Go and register to vote, EMAS, regardless of the shenanigans of the UPND who want to tilt the registration of voters in areas they consider, you know, their strongholds. Let's all go and vote and prepare to come and vote these people out. There is no other way. Every well-meaning Zambian, I'm almost tempted to say every normal Zambian can only go and vote out UPND. Thank you very much. All right. You have been listening to the Catching Edge program.